these last few months. I'm gonna be a father. Oh, shit. It's a few months long now. And he's a good dad for that. Ready to be an emotional wreck for the sixth week in a row? Hey guys, welcome back to the video, and this is reacting to episode six of HBO Max's The Last of Us. This show has been insane so far, and I'm so excited to continue it. Also, stick to the end of this video after my reaction to hear my full spoiler review and thoughts. And as always, let me know your thoughts on this episode in the comments down below. Both don't waste any more time. Let's get right into it. No, I can't believe we have to watch this again. Give me the gun, Henry. Give me the gun. Henry, no! Uh, okay, we're in the snow, like the snow biome now. Three months later? Dang. And the gun. The gun's all the way over there. Dude, I absolutely love this score, too. I'm responsible for you, okay? Then don't fall asleep. I was quiet. I. Dude, this cinematography is amazing. It was beautiful. I love the snow biome. I knew from the trailers, we got one of the trailers and obviously it was snow biome. Um, and then my friend last week had told me, he's like, oh, next week's episode takes place in the snow biome. I was like, that's sick. It's gonna look so far. Oh my god. Tommy! Oh shit. <laughs> A bad reputation doesn't mean you're bad. Not always, at least. <laughs> I'm gonna be a father. Oh shit. It's a few months long now. He's a good dad for that. I guess we'll find out. <laughs> That's all you got? What else am I supposed to say? Aww. So then you understand my concern. He doesn't do that anymore. He stopped, stopped killing people? Innocent ones. And Tommy did it too. Are you worried about him? Damn! The only people who can betray us are the ones we trust. Bars! Bars. Mm -hmm. bars! Bars, bars, bars. You know, she saved my life there. Five years ago, I would have destroyed him. She had to shoot him to save me. Fourteen years old. Oh, and too fucking deaf to hear him coming. I saw a man kill his own brother to save her while I just watched. And today, I thought that dog was going to tear her apart because it smelled something on her. I couldn't move. I couldn't think of anything to say. I just, I was so afraid. You think I can still handle things, but no matter what was. Lately, there are these moments where the fear comes up out of nowhere, and my heart, I've lost something. I'm failing in my sleep. You want me to take her? I'm just going to get her killed. I know it. I know it. And I have to leave her. Well, here's your chance to bring your kid into a better world. You're younger than me. You're still strong. You said it yourself. You'll come back. You have to take her. Do you give a shit about me or not? Of course I do. Then what are you so afraid of? I'm not her, you know. You have no idea what loss is. Everybody I have cared for has either died or left me. Everybody fucking except for you! So don't tell me that I'd be safe with somebody else because the truth is, I would just be more scared. Bro, this show is so good. Oh my god. Two banger scenes back to back. You deserve a choice. I still think you'd be better off with Tommy. Let's go. Okay. 
gentle, steady, nice and slow. You're gonna shoot this thing or get it pregnant? <laughs> it isn't gonna work. It doesn't aim right. You dick. God, that shot is amazing. Dude, what a shot again! Oh my god. I don't want a sheep ranch, actually. I mean, if the deal is I can do anything. Nice to do. Well, when I was a kid, I wanted to be a singer. <laughs> <laughs> it's gotta be infected, dude. It's gotta be. God damn it. Oh my god. This feels like such a bad idea. What an episode. Um, thoughts on it? Uh, I The thing is, the ending was great. I think it hit really hard. It's just that we know Joel's obviously not dead. So, um, But I do think next episode will end up being the Ellie backstory. Because I don't know if it's a whole episode dedicated to it, but I know that we're getting Ellie's backstory. For like, I don't, I don't know if it's in the game. Maybe it's just a show exclusive thing. But yeah, um, as for the episode as a whole, really, really loved it. I think it's top three episodes. Um, I think I go episode six, episode five, episode three as my top three as of now. Um, yeah, this episode was really great. I know I didn't say much during the actual episode, like while I was watching it, but I just felt like really like encapsulated by like the world this time, especially because like we saw like a new civilization and also like the whole thing with Tommy. I thought that was all really really good and. I really just love the way they play with emotion here. Like, there's little to no action in this episode. Like, obviously, we have the little thing at the very end of this episode, but other than that, we don't really have any action. And um, they still made it very, very emotional, which I really, really liked. Um, I, there was, like, I would say there's, like, three, four total scenes in this entire episode that are just heartbreaking. Um, I wouldn't say it's as heartbreaking as... Like, it, the thing is, it's not, like... It wasn't, like, shocking moments heartbreaking. Like, the stab thing was really shocking at the in the moment, but, like, it wasn't anything like last episode. Um, like, that ending was absurd. And then episode three's ending was, like, it was sad, right? This was, like, sad, but it was, like, emotional. Like, last episode and last review, I talked about how... Um, whenever something sad happens to Joel and Ellie, we'll feel so much more emotion because we feel so much emotion for these characters that we're meeting for just one episode. And I really felt that this time, especially like, I thought the conversation between Joel and Ellie in the bedroom, that was an amazing scene. But I think the scene with Tommy is really what like kind of connected with me more emotionally because of like the fear and the anxiety and stuff like that. And I think that worked really well for us already knowing Joel's character and the way that all that plays out, I really, really love that. Um, I, I like to reiterate in this every single video, like all of the last of videos. I haven't seen the show. I mean, I haven't seen the, I haven't played the game. I haven't seen any of the game. Um, I don't know anything about the game. So I'm viewing all of this as a first time watcher, experiencing it through the show firsthand. And so I don't know what's in the show and what's not in the show, but I really love all of the elements, especially with Tommy's character. One thing I do know is that all the 
side characters are aren't nearly as fleshed out as they are in this show and so i don't know what elements of tommy are present in the game and the show but i just really love the way his character is not only fleshed out here but also like the connection that we get between him and joel as well as joel and like everyone else in the town and how there's a sense of like resentment because they live such like pretty they live pretty good lives and so compared to him and what he's gone through and stuff like that and so i just really love the way that um all of that came together in this episode and just also just the character work is amazing uh like i say in every single one of these episode reactions cinematography sound design score um everything is also just super well done again i like this episode because it doesn't like i think like for example episode episodes five and three they really had action and emotional moments and they balanced them really well but i think this episode is so good and it had me so invested enthralled engaged and it barely had any action sequences like at all and so i really really love that it was purely story based moving the story forward moving our characters forward nothing really action reliant yet it was still super duper entertaining and it was just like an amazing episode again. Had me engaged 110% of the way through. But guys, that's it for my reaction and review for episode six of HMX is The Last of Us. As always, let me know what you thought of this episode in the comments down below and subscribe so you don't miss my reaction to next week's episode. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time. Peace.